been thinking about this question, what makes a good trail shoe? A good trail shoe has a lot of traction to grip uneven surfaces or terrain, so that's one thing you're looking for. And this definitely does that. You can see the lugs right here, right? This is gripping all kinds of terrain. A good trail shoe also features a reinforced midsole to help protect your feet from all the real rocks and debris and twigs, branches, everything that's out there while you on a trail. Shoes with thicker and wider soles are becoming more popular, hence you can see, because you know, we all about stability, the stable boys. We ain't trying to roll our ankles and all that. We trying to be able to land however we land and still be good, you heard? If you're a brand new trail runner and you don't want to feel all the rocks and the dirt and the twigs and the branches while you run and you want something that has a little extra comfort with really good lugs and grip on the ground, this is the joint for you. It's very different from the Norda. The Norda, you can feel more of the ground. This one, you don't feel the ground as much. You feel more of the cushioning because of the high stack on this joint. You feel me? Overall, this joint is pretty good. I did about 50 miles, 60 miles in it, and it don't have really much wear on it. I just feel like I'm very protected in this shoe, and it keeps my foot very warm. This is a max cushion trail shoe, so if you're looking for something that you feel the ground is ain't for you, but if you're looking to get in the trail running and you don't want to feel those things on your feet and you want to go long distances and have your feet not feel like they beat up, then this is definitely the joint for you. New Balance did a crazy joint for this one. It looks great on any, and I mean any surface, whether you're on the trails or you're on the concrete or you're on asphalt, this does great for everything. So I think I think best case scenario, this is that you got a long week beating up your legs on the road, whether you're doing workouts, all that different things to train for your marathon, and then on the weekend, that Sunday, you got that long 15 mile run or you got that 12 mile run or that eight mile run and you wanna do it in the trails to be soft on your knees, I think this is the one for you, you heard? So if you're looking for a trail fashion shoe when it comes to it, I think this is the one for you for the fashion. Cause you're gonna look good while you're going down, you're doing your grocery shopping, you're doing anything, or you want to look. Also, if you want to take a nice little walk on the trails, you gotta do a hiking trip or anything like that, you're gonna be in your outdoors bag, this is the one for you. Shouts to District Risen, like I said, this is very this is a very stylish, one of the better looking trail shoes out there. <laughs> Balance district vision. Y'all yeah, was on to something. But at time of fielding, this might be sold out. Should you get a second hand, I don't know, they probably gonna try to kill you with the prices. So you may not need to do that, but the regular New Balance, maybe not for this collab. Then get it, if you can get a pair of these, maybe not the District Vision New Balance collab, you still got a good trail shoe. And you're gonna look cool while you're doing it. You're gonna have to actually, you know, protect your knees, you heard? Very stable, do your thing. <laughs> All right, Free Thinkers, it's been a pleasure, you heard? Tell you out.